G'day everyone and welcome back to Subsistence. Um, we have a trap level 1 moose. Uh, it is dawn. Dawn is breaking. It's early morn as the song uh, as the song goes. And I'm going to try and shoot this moose. Well, we could go arrows. How much, um, how much SVT, SVT each do we have here? Let's turn this light off. Ooh. Quick. Uh, we got plenty of SVT. Uh, is that fire? It's a little bit of time before we have to deal with the fire. Alright. Let's, uh, SVT the moose in the back of the Oh man, we just killed our first moose. Um Okay. Moose dead. So we just learned something. A moose that is shot. does not um a shot moose doesn't uh chase you oh shit that, that wolf probably is um crap that wolf's gonna get in the way of me hunting me capturing this kill you're dead too. Oh, he jumped me, you cheeky little fecker. You cheeky little fecker. When you get between a man and his moose, we have a problem. What are we gonna get? Holy Hannah! Four sinew. Wow. Rise! Rise! I oh, cool, we did the wash hands, nice. Need to... Reload the shoddy. Oh, nice! Nice! Alright, let's come up inside. Let's have a look at what our moose kill got us. Okay, we got a liver, we got some fat, we got a, we got a steak, a rack of ribs, nice. And yes, it can be cut into steaks also. Um, but we're going to put that in the fridge. We got some antlers. Sinews, nice. Uh, who's going to put the liver and the steak on? Put the fat on. Put the uh, sinew in it. 31 sinew. Good. Good shizzle, that is. Now, we're going to come up here. We're going to put the rack of ribs in there. Put that in there. Uh, I'll grab an extra steak. Have a Tommy, couple of Tommy tomatoes. And an apple. That should top our fruit and veg levels off just nicely. Pop that steak in there. Very good. Alright. So, what are we going to do today? We've got to let power come up. We've got some good mass, but I want to let power come up. I wouldn't mind building... I would need for another solar panel. Uh, 550 burns all my mass. That's the problem. Mass is so hard to come by. You're either just like... Would you just hurry up and cook? Smash those. So what's going on out here? Probably going to get a revenge from Betamax. Um, but I think we're going to go up one tree. We're going to go up six tree hill today. See what's going up, going on up that way. 
Oh, I need one bandage. Wow. Uh, one, two, three, four. Give me five of those bad boys. Yeah, come on. Cook up. Cook up. Come on. So I'm going to go and check out my old loot spot. Um, my old lock crate areas up around 6 Tree. And that kind of stuff. Uh, make sure that the neighbours aren't coming by. Go fishing. No, beautiful. Alright. We haven't done anything to piss Charlie off lately, so... They'd only be due for a periodical. Uh. Alright, let's rock on. Building crate, nice. Just what we need to uh, start the day. Well, I hate to say this, but that moose was really easy to kill. It does the same... Be if the moose comes by your house, it does the same... It does the same behaviour as a wolf. If you shoot a moose from your deck, it runs like a wolf. It doesn't charge like a bear. I... Can I go out on a limb and say I'm a bit disappointed? Um, damn. Lots of fiber each around here, eh? Um, yeah, I'm... I'm not happy about that. I was expecting the moose to, um... Charge my base, so... Alright, let's get this six trees, see what Charlie are up to. Ooh! I'm making a little bit of progress, they haven't... They haven't started building this... Oh, look, he's on the roof! Have a look at him! He's on the... He's on the top of the first floor. Is he getting ready to start building the second floor? I don't know. No, I don't really... Really don't have time to stand around here and find out because I have places to go and loot to see. There's a wolf just on the other side of the bridge we need to uh, be wary of. So yeah, really happy. Killed a moose. Really good. Uh, by the end of the day I'd like to have built either the flashlight attachment or the recurve bow. I'm not entirely sure which one I want to go for first. Um, the only problem I have, I like the idea of the recurve bow, but I don't like the idea of misses break. Well, I don't tend to miss. Um, the other thing I want to make is I want to make the baking pan because the I want to cook that rack of ribs and I want to cook it in a baking pan. So the problem I have. I need like a billion metal ingots to make the bacon pan. Um, I literally need more metal ingots to make the bacon pan than I do for the um, solar pan. Which I find. Uh, I find it rather perplexing. But it is what it is. It's uh Sorry, I just I really like this copse of four four trees. Uh, I just want to get these. We need we need wood, and some of this wood is just going to go straight into the recycler. Um, yeah, we can recycle wood. Yeah, let's just make sure there's no... Ooh, there's a cloth deposit there. Ooh, ammo crate. Um, I was going to say, let's just make sure there's no uh, hunters up here. Oh, rogues, rogues, sorry, rogues. There's a miscreant wolf, which... I don't really want to get involved with that wolf if I can avoid it. I want that ready ammo crate. So I was hoping... There's a little bit of wolf repellent in it. Mm. I'm not seeing... I'm not seeing rogues up here. Doesn't mean they're not around. They do occasionally like to hang out here. I'm 
there have been times when I've been climbing this hill and it's been like a hello I'm a rogue doesn't appear so today now oh another gee I thought moose was supposed to be rare I don't know about you, but that's another moose just over there. They don't seem that ready rare to me. Um, now, there's two reasons I want this wood. One, four, well, three reasons. Repairs. Mass. And, uh... Building material. Because, uh... I have a project I want to do. And I want to talk to everyone. I want to talk to you all about it. It's an interesting project. So, and I've talked about it before. Basically, what I want to do is I want to do... I want to circumnavigate the map. Now, do a map circumnavigation, I believe I need... To build at least one, if not two... Um... Outposts. Because I don't think you can. The, the state. The size of the map as it stands now. I don't believe can be circumnavigated safely in one day. So. My. My current plan is to... Sorry, just getting my bearings back. Uh, for some reason I can't see my... Oh, it's there. Cool. Um, I want to get... So yeah, part of the planning for that is working out where my functional rest stops are going to be. So, I think one needs to be sort of up there near the... on the other side of the red forest and then probably up there somewhere. Almost up the mountain. Um, they're the two places I'm thinking about putting pit stops, run bases, whatever you really want to call them. The functionality is the same. It's uh, lock crate. How do I get down there? Not getting dead. Where's that wolf? There. Clear the wolf. Alright. Come here, lock crate. Ah, shit, burgers. Oh, that's right there. Oh my, oh shit, two wolves are guarding it. Oh, wolf repellent. Nice. Um, that is not... As far as I'm concerned, that's not a bad lock crate. I will take a lock crate of that magnitude any day. Because it gives me exactly what I want. It gives me... Just out for just out for rog use. That's what I want. That's the tool. Um. Yeah. So it gives me everything I wanted. New wolf repellent. Gives me some SVT to replace the SVT that I shot the the moose with. Um. That lock crate covered all my needs. So yeah, um, I'm planning for that in the next few episodes. Um, when I do it, I'm going to do... I'm probably going to do something my buddy Ono did. And that's put the Hunters on Revenge only. My reasoning for doing that is because... Look, I probably am going to be away for two days, at least. Um, and I don't really want them destroying my base while I'm away. Of 
because I worked really hard on it. We gathered a buttload of materials. So, my plan is that we'll switch the hunters to uh, revenge only. We'll let That way we can let Charlie build up, we can go and do our trip around the world, so to speak. Um, go to parts we haven't visited for a long time. I mean, I haven't been to the Red Forest for ages. I also want to build up supplies. I probably want to take, like... I definitely want to take BCUs with me. I want to put BCUs in each base. There. Um, in, e in each outpost. So that I can... craft. When I'm there. So that means I probably need to take... Um, a solar panel... and a mass fabricator. I may not want to craft it. I don't know. I haven't... I'm certainly going to be taking a... Um, I'm definitely going to be taking one of those... Um, a wood burner. So we can cook... We can cook food and render... <coughs> fat. Um... Yeah. Oh, that's right. Just a clock deposit. Looking out at the road, I see you. Oh man, I'm really disappointed in myself. You know, I, I promised myself when I did the whole killing the moose thing, I was going to do like a full-on impersonation of the Swedish chef. Because yep. um, there's that classic there's that classic Swedish chef, chef scene where he explains how to make chocolate mousse. And the Swedish chef explains how to make chocolate mousse by saying to make the mousse, first you need the mousse. To get the mousse you need the blondie mousse. Yeah, moosey, moosey, moosey. Uh, classic, classic Swedish uh, chef. Those of you who are too young to know who the Swedish chef is, might I direct your attention to the search bar at the end of this video, and uh, you look up on YouTube, the Swedish chef. He was one of the uh, one of the greats of the Muppet era. I highly recommend and endorse his comedy stylings to you. Let's go and get the six tree as well. This is a dangerous six tree because there could literally be rugs on the other side of this rock. On the other side of this rock. But yes, I do recommend the Swedish Chef. Very, very funny stuff. How are we going for wood? 92. Ooh. There we go. Let's have uh, lunch. Beautiful. Perfectly timed lunch right at lunchtime. The traditional time of the day to engage in the pursuit of lunch. Looking out at the room. Uh. To be honest, not sure why I've got Jackson Brown stuck in my head, other than the fact that Jackson Brown is awesome! Ooh, and a wolf. Probably as close to chuckles as I want to get. He's literally on the other side of that rise. This uh, 
this tree is of course where Ono, Game Edge and Co have their co-op base. Ooh. Afternoon Creek spawns on tonight. Um, dead Wolf, potentially. If he decides if he decides he wants to interfere with my wood gathering, he is so so dead. Um Yeah, they they're built around that tree, which is really cool. Um, very Swiss family Robinson y. Uh, having said that, uh, I am hankering to do a tree base in this, this game too. And I'm. Yeah, it's something that may happen sooner rather than later at this point. Um, the next season may be a tree base. Oh, Jesus. We don't really want to be there. That was some pretty dangerous territory we were hunkered down in there. Let's get the wolf repellent ready. I don't like coming over these blind ridges. There we go. Yeah, a bit of weather coming in. Yeah, they've got a really interesting spot for their horde base. I really like it. Um, and I've always wanted to build like a Swiss family Robinson. Um, tribute base, I guess. Um, for those of you not familiar with the classic uh, movie and book, The Swiss Family Robinson, I am. Uh, I highly recommend you check it out. Good honest, uh, good honest family viewing, fun for the whole clan. Um, get to buck ten in wood, nice. Oh look, cloth deposit. You know what? Sorry. Sorry, not sorry. Two of them. Mm. I'd love to shoot the crud out of them right now. Uh, starting to draw. The evening. The evening is starting to draw upon us. I'd like to get. Oh, old mate's fishing. Ooh. Should have bought the SVT. Oh, bloody wolf. Right, how do we... How do we make use of this? Because he's going to jack rounds at me. That wolf aggro's. I'm going straight across the. Uh, no, so the wolf, wolf, wolf wouldn't follow me. Oh, he's caught a fish. I can't believe he ran away. Oh, he's going to attack my base. 
Okay. Yeah, that's gonna work, Sunshine. I can't believe he took that much of my health down with one shotgun blast. Oh, he had a salmon too! A <laughs> sucker! Oh shit, his mate's coming. Betamax are here. Huh. Wow, they've only taken that whole wall down. Wow. Cool. Double attack, I like it. Crap, we're full. That's right. <gasps> Gears, piss off. Um. Mm. Oh, no. Let's just. Uh. Do that. Let's quickly duck inside. Because I'm going to pop if I take his crate. Just need to make a little bit of space. Um, that's that. That. That'll be tons. Just don't want to lose that crate. Ooh, yeah, that was worth it. Ooh, bad weather's coming too. Oh, you know the worst part? Alpha is totally unguarded right now. Oh crap. Where's that coming from? That's Charlie! <laughs> oh, you got me! We had everyone attack us. Um. Right, so we had triple attacks. had every hunter on the map attack us today. We killed them all. Wow. 
Um, busy day. My shooting wasn't great. Um, which I fill it. Uh, yeah, so one thing we're going to have to do is make some med kits because I used way too many for that. Uh, let's keep those. Free salmon, thank you very much, Mr. Hunter. so much work for time. Man, we've got like six, seven, eight hundred. Oh, yeah. Ooh, that's a power situation. Five, only ten. That'll give me plenty of spares. Beautiful. Then medicinal tonic. Perfect. Keep that there. Bugger. Burnt the rabbit. That was a bit silly. Let's just check our... Uh, check our plants and then we'll finish off for the... Oops. will get made by the time these go we'll be touch and go Don't get to uh, just in case we don't get to the fuel bricks. Right, so I want to split half, split half, half in there. Make the fuel bricks first, and then we can make medical tools.
Perfect. All right. Well, I'm going to uh, I'm going to leave this episode here. So I want to thank you all for joining us. Um, if you enjoyed this episode of uh, Sub Subsistence, where we went around and we killed a bunch of hunters, we had a bunch of fun, we cooked some of this for our breakfast. Had a lot of fun. Uh, made some good planks. Beautiful. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, didn't put our ash away. We'll leave that there for now. So yeah. Uh, if you yes, if you enjoyed this episode, please remember to leave a like, thumbs up, all that good stuff. If you're new to the channel and want to see more of this beautiful game subsistence. And Seven Days That I and all the other games we rock. And some new ones coming very, very soon. Uh, please subscribe and hit the notification button. And comments. Please feel free to leave comments because we need to make a lockpick. So yeah. Thanks again for joining us. And uh, until next time... We go out into the subsistence land and see what wackiness can shoot around us. As always, ladies. <laughs>